So in El Salvador, obviously they have a lot of gangs and whatnot, and you hear a lot about it. And I didn't really have any experience with the gangs until the very end of my mission. And they still didn't bug us that much. But um, in Belize, like, there are a lot of um, people from other Latin American countries that go there for safety because it is a very like safe place. The only place that's dangerous at all is Belize City, where it's... Um, like the missionaries there, they do have to go in at 8 instead of at 9 because it's a little more frightening. People say, steal stuff there some. But it's still generally pretty safe. And the good thing about El Salvador is that they are all very religious people. So just walking around with a shirt and tie and a name tag, then you're okay. Generally, they won't bug you. And the gangs, they just bugged us once in El Salvador. And they they're really just like scared of the other gangs and everything. I thought it was really interesting that they they bugged us. But um, they want to see your phone to make sure that you're not like calling or te texting other gangs and maybe your camera make sure you're not taking pictures and they were like talking to the people we were with saying oh they could be spies from the US or something but, but we were okay. And so it just made me thankful that that I don't have to live in that kind of a situation, that they really are just afraid of everything. Like, if a, if a skinny white guy walks through your midst and, and you're scared out of your minds, then think something's wrong. But I didn't have my camera at that time. You're not really supposed to bring your camera around. 